Welcome to our tutorial on managing subscriptions with your databank. Subscription management is an optional part of the databank's e-marketing and advocacy modules. This tutorial will show you how to select subscribers when sending a message, edit subscriptions for an individual, and subscribe a selection to a publication. Now let's begin. We'll start with this Power Mail issue. Let's say that we would like to send this to the subscription list for the Humdinger Alumni Monthly publication. I'm going to start by going to search and then choose subscriptions. Under subscriptions I can see a list of all of the publications I have set up for Humdinger College and I'm going to choose the Humdinger Alumni Monthly list and click find. That brings up my list of subscribers. Then I can go to the selection menu, bring up that Power Mail message again. Here it is. And I'm done editing the message, so I'll go directly to Publish, skip to the bottom of the page, and now I'm going to send the real message. And we go over the Power Mail in another tutorial called Sending a Power Mail Bulk Email Message, so I'm not going to spend any more time on that right now. Secondly, say you want to edit subscriptions for an individual. For example, um, let's say, let's go back to our selection here, let's say that Julius Aronson phones you and asks to be removed from the Humdinger Alumni Monthly list. He could have unsubscribed himself using the link in the message. But if you need to intervene, you go into his record, click on his subscriptions, and then you'll see a list there and you can check or uncheck whichever ones um, according to his preference. So I'll uncheck Humdinger Alumni Monthly, save the changes, and now he's removed from that list. Then finally, you can select a list and subscribe the whole batch to a publication. And in order to do this step, you need to have permissions to the setup menu, which is here in your databank. For example, let's say that you've started a special newsletter for um, Arizona alumni of Humdinger College. I'll start by searching for people in Arizona. It's in the personal information. I'm going to page down to the state and look for just everyone in Arizona. You could, of course, narrow it to alumni if you have a field to track that. So here are my 190 Arizona residents. Then I'll go to the Setup menu to Publications, and this is where I assign that list to the publication. Here's Arizona Alumni News. I'll click Subscribe Member Selection and Save. And that's it. Good luck.